What do you think? You look like a chandelier. You're like so yesterday, Tommy. Yeah, man, the chicks dig them. I know the chicks dig them. That's why they wear them. Look at that one. Gimme, give gimme. Give Bigger earrings equals more chicks. Oh. Well then, bring on the bait. Fishing lure, shiny, you bite. <laughs> Cool. Look at the size of that one. Where? No, don't pull. I'm not pulling you. Uh... I am not, jerk face. I told you. Yeah, you guys are definitely a couple of chick magnets. There once was a Frenchman, Yvonne was his name. Exploring new worlds he dreamed was his fame. But reading a map was not his forte. So poor Yvonne was soon cast away. Yvonne, Yvonne how do you come? Sailing the stormy seas. Yvonne, Yvonne, how do you come? No one could hear his pleas. He soon found himself in a bit of a pickle. The frigid North Seas proved more than fickle. Yvonne's navigation would soon cost a price. He was knocked overboard and turned into ice. Yvonne, Yvonne Yvonne, half was volunteer. Yvonne, Yvonne, all the Yvonne, frozen for hundreds of years. Three hundred years passed, and with some irony, his scheme was thought of by what's need to be. Yvonne claimed the land for his country's glory, and, and that's, that's the start of the Yvonne story. Yvonne, Yvonne, all the Yukon, frozen by icy seas. Yvonne, all the Yukon, defrosted for you and for me. That's it! I don't believe you guys! All we do is sit around watching other people live their lives on TV. Everything's happening somewhere else. Somewhere else? Hey, tell me, maybe we should move there, huh? Chad, find out where we are. Chop, chop! Y yes sir Hi, is this Shiver Me Timbers? Uh-uh. Shiver Me Timbers is 200 miles west of here. This is up your muckluck. Up your muckluck. Up your muckluck. Nope. Don't see that here. Oh, guess your quaint little town ain't on the map, kid. What are you talking about? Let me see that. Jesus Cole? Shiver Me Timbers? Frostbottom Falls? We're not on the map. Worse than that, somewhere else is not on the map either. Hey, come back here with our map. Have you seen this? Up your muckluck, our town is not on the map anymore. But that can't be. It'll ruin my business. As far as I'm concerned, the fewer people that know about this unsavory little bug, the better. But I was born here. Up your muckluck is my hometown. Hmm, the Duke's got a point. Who needs more flea-bitten strangers coming in here screwing things up, huh? Howdy, strangers. What can I get you? Chad, answer the man. Uh, yeah. Hi. Uh, can you tell us where the nearest Ritz is? Oh, sure thing, mister. No, he didn't mean crackers. He meant a Ritz hotel, you idiot. A hotel made out of crackers? Who's calling who an idiot? <laughs> <laughs> Chad, they're mocking me. Grease their palms. Chop, chop. Yes, sir. Now, I'd appreciate it if you'd stop mocking my uncle and tell us where the nearest hotel is. Wow, one whole dollar. One whole American dollar, which is worth a boatload of anything else. Uh-huh. 
Well, the closest thing to a hotel is the Nosh and Nap up the way. They've got decent beds and complimentary blubber flapjacks. Charming! Phone! You have a phone we could use? Right over there. Carter? Well, put it in! Oh, right. Well, don't just stand there. Dial! Uh, yes, sir. This is outrageous! It's astronomical! Don't any of you care? Keep it down, kid, and watch the map. Oh, sorry. Man, you're the coolest! No, you're the coolest! Hey! Maybe we're both the coolest! Yeah, I mean, how could we possibly look any cooler? Man, I'd love to get my hands on whoever's responsible for taking us off the map. But say, that metal looks expensive. Mm-hmm. Head office gave it to me. It's the Honorable Tightwad of the Month Award for having the best cost-cutting suggestion. And what might that have been? Oh, a little snip here, trim the fat there. Uh, I suggested they drop small towns with big names from all the maps in order to save money on ink. Tommy, you hold them down. I'll beat them up. Got it. Yes, this is Dick Whitless from Whitless Book of World Records. We don't get to shiver me timbers till tomorrow, so have a hot bath and a masseuse on standby. Ciao, Bella! Are you really from the Whitless Book of World Records? Kid, there's a guy in Shiver Me Timber says he's got four belly buttons. My job is to make sure they ain't pimples, get it? Chad, give this kid a free copy. If you're ever in Hollywood, call my people. We'll do lunch. Chad, door! Call my people? Call them what? Son, maybe you're overreacting to this map thing. Dad, if we're not on the map, nobody knows we're even alive. So what? I'm here, you're there. We know we're alive. You know that Yvonne's gotta be the best darn wrestler in the whole world. That's it! <laughs> Why didn't I think of this before? Come on, Mutt, we've got work to do. Emergency town meeting, six o'clock sharp, bingo barn. Billy Crudwither from Timbuktu has the longest eyebrows in the world. Clarissa Montclair from Oshkosh has 350 distinct personalities. Laszlo Grundweller from Dusseldorf holds the record for stuffing the most eels in his pants at 256. Each of these people are in the Witless Book of Records. But what do they have in common? They're all a bunch of freaks! Well, I mean, besides that, don't you see? The Witless Book of World Records always mentions the name of the town that these people are from. Timbuktu, Dusseldorf, Oshkosh. If someone from Up Your Muck Luck breaks a world record, it'll get written up in that book. Up Your Muck Luck will once again become gloriously famous! And they'll have to put us back on the map again. Yes! But it also means that we can't let Witless leave until one of us succeeds. Oh, I, I saw them checking out of the Nosh and Nap on the way over. Oh. oh.
Uh, for the glory of France and King Louis, if Vaughn shall find this witless dick guy and keep him here until we break a record. <laughs> Chad, those blubber flapjacks are moving through me. Wait, you can't leave. And why not? Oh, because, because of this woman, she is yours if you stay. Get your hands off me, you French leprechaun. I mean, this man. Don't be ridiculous. You can't leave because uh, you haven't signed my book yet. <sighs> Oh, all right. I guess I can make time for my adoring public. Chad, Ed. Just make it out to, uh, Thomas, William, Xavier, Fernandez, D'Artagnan, Tabernacle, Scrimshaw, Blatherwick, Agamemnon, Takya. Kid, you've got more names than a New York phone book. Yeah, but is it a world record? Not even close. Chad, let's move! So long, folks, and remember, if it ain't a world record, it ain't in the book! Chad, onward! <laughs> Chad? I'm not happy either, sir. Fix it! Okay, uh, see you tomorrow, then. So, what can I get you, Mr. Whitless? Might I suggest my delicious mousse tortier au fumé? Oh, that sounds... Uh... Great. Okay, mousse tortier coming right up. No! Tortier's in the oven. Hey, you know, it's amazing how everyone has a hidden talent. Take me, for instance. Who would have guessed a guy like me could juggle pork chops, huh? That's it. No more. Oh, Mr. Whitless. I didn't know you were here. But since you are, have you ever seen anyone spin a dozen loopy hoops at the same time? Get out of my way. Ah! Chad, help! Yes, sir. Get me out of here. Sir, might I suggest the back door? Excuse me, but what is the longest anyone has worn a live chicken on their head? Have you ever seen bees like these? Try. World record for drinking pickle juice is 15 gallons. Who said anything about a record? I love the pickle juice. You know, Tommy, maybe it's not just about the map. Maybe it's about you. Huh? I'll tell you a story, and maybe you'll understand it, and maybe you won't. I knew this fella once, who craved fame and fortune in the big city. After hitting hard times, this fella ends up in a small backwards town way up north. But you know what? This fella ended up more famous and happy than if he stayed in the big city. Dad, I'm pretty sure I know who you're talking about. Mm, yup. It was Santa Claus. All clear, sir.
Savages, you've gone too far. I'll make sure you never work on this tundra again. Huh, Tommy? Maybe you think we go too far? Too late now. I'll have your badge for this. We haven't broken any laws. Oh, no? Well, let's just have a look here. <laughs> Let's see now. Shoe shine cloth, oatmeal soap, zesty kumquat foot exfoliator, all from the Nasha Nap. Cold weather makes me chafe, sir. I have the right to a phone call. I want my phone call! Oh, geez, well, sorry. Blower's on the fritz. You'll have to sit tight till one of us breaks a record, which shouldn't be long now. Luba! Come on! <laughs> What are you doing? It's upside down! Huh? Oops. Oh, never mind. Keep going! It's our best chance. We gotta break the record for the world's tallest human pyramid! Could you hurry up, please? Uh, I think maybe I have too much of the pickle juice. I got it! We call a repairman, have the phone fixed, and then make the call. You idiot! Why didn't you tell me you brought a phone? Just for emergencies. Will this be a local call? World Records, I'm all ears. It's me, Witless. Go red. No pink. Get us out of here! Yvonne cannot perform with everyone watching. The mission had taken out a life of its own. Every day those idiots got stronger while I got weaker. What was I doing there? The horror. The horror. What a 
does he think he's doing? Yes, I knew they wouldn't let me down. <laughs> Respect. I quit! You can't quit! Who tie my shoelaces and take all my abuse and read <laughs> oh, They can't leave! We haven't broken a record yet! Oh man, now we'll never get on the map. Hey, we might not get back on the map, but think of all the things we learned about each other. Big Mary, you're terrific with the loopy hoops, and Dad? Well, I've known you all my life, and I didn't know you could juggle. Oh, uh, jeez. I can't. I cheated. Yeah, but at least you tried. So we're not on the map. Who cares? We don't need a map to tell us who we are. We know who we are. My body piercings gave me more infections than yours. Did not. Did do. Did not. Did not. Did not. Did do. Did do. Did do. Did do. Guess what? We made it. We're famous. What are you talking about? The new witless book of world records. We're in it. We are? <laughs> Craziest place on earth. Up your muck luck. Oh, great. Now everybody's gonna think we're nuts. Yvonne is proud of Tommy and your stupid record. Thanks, Yvonne. We are not crazy, are we? Excuse me, is this up your muck luck? Craziest place on earth? Uh, nope. This is Shiver Me Timbers, yeah. Up your mucklucks about 200 miles west of here. Eh, danke. Yeah, you schneiden nicht mehr in ihre Schäden. Sie waschen nicht lebende. Tourists, who needs them?